Hi, G4YVM here again. Um, I've had a few people say to me that the videos on the website are uh, fine, but they'd like to see videos of the sleeve antenna actually in use. So I've come to a place in Wiltshire called Pepperbox Hill, where, if I'm honest, I've never had any success with the radio. Um, there was an article in Practical Wireless uh, a year ago, I think, a chap came up here and uh, he had no success either but we're in good company because Marconi also established the station up here apparently and he had very little success as well and I suspect it's because it's a big lump of chalk uh, it's really not conducive to radio signals but I came here because it's local and it might work uh, however it's also um, mid-June at the moment yesterday I think there were zero sunspots on the uh, on the sun during this cycle 25 so the HF bands are as dead as they can possibly be. So in terms of an advertising video, this is pretty rubbish. But I want to show you what we've got. And I want to show you the, air, the aerial tuning. So here we are. The antenna that I'm using. There's the Anun. Clamped to the mast. Uh, there's the camouflage sleeve uh, on top of the, the mast. You can just see the, there's a bit dangling at the end there. It just isn't fully on the mast. That's also not an issue. And uh, that's just in one of the, uh, the, the drive-on uh stands this is the radio this is the zegu g90 currently on uh, 80 meters just going to press the tune button and um it should you will we'll see it there's the swr so when that's fully white the antenna is not tuned when it's less that so if that were transmitting now that would be perfectly tuned so let's see what happens there we go uh, I'm going to switch that to uh, AM so that you can see the event, the effect of uh, of tuning <coughs> on this um, antenna. Get the microphone. Uh, so let's watch the SWR on that there. So that's uh, that's a good SWR. A lower sideband. Golf four Yankee vector mic, and you can see the SWR there barely moving. That's on 80 meters. Uh, let's try top band. This is absolutely raw video. I have no idea what's going to happen when I press the tune on top band. Should tune on top band, but we'll see, shall we? There we go. Uh, let's go back to AM. And we'll just transmit. So that's a good SWR on top band. 20 meters. Um, let's try that. There we are. That's tuned. Now I do, I, I do um, there's a station on 40. I want to try and get him. I'm just going to turn the car on. Hang on a second. Um, I'll come back to you while that's happening. The, this car, I can't use the cigar lighter whilst I'm, uh, whilst the engine's, whilst the key's not turned on, if that makes sense. It hasn't got a sort of an auxiliary setting, which is a bit odd. Uh, which is a shame. So I've just turned the car on just to save running it without the engine running. I don't know whether that's bad for it or not, but I don't like to do it. So this is somebody on, on 40 metres I can hear. So what you've just seen is, is me tuning this antenna. Now, okay, I do accept that the G90 ATU is, is a very good ATU, uh, but most rigs ATUs are good these days. So if you've got a G90, it's a very popular radio. Uh, that will tune the sleeve no problem kx2 will tune the sleeve kx3 will tune the sleeve uh ldgs will tune the sleeve anything tunes the sleeve it's just great so this is 40 meters i was trying to contact somebody on 40 meters to be honest i've had no joy the band is is pretty flat uh, we can have a tune around and see what we can get Golf 4 Yankee Charlie Alpha. This is Golf 4 Yankee Victor Mike, portable for you. Golf 4 Yankee Charlie Alpha, Golf 4 Yankee Victor Mike, portable. Golf 
This is Golf 4 Yankee Victor Mike Portable. Golf 4 Yankee Victor Mike Portable. Do you copy? Yeah, seven threes, Andy. Bye bye. Uh, Let's start the engine. Well, okay, that's not bad. He was running 160 watts. I was running 20. Uh, he's on a uh, his big aerial, and I'm on the sleeve. And um, we had a nice QSO. So that's the sleeve antenna. It it it, it works. Difficult conditions today, and I'm not going to sit here and tell you that I've just managed to work everyone I've called because I haven't. But uh, there we are. I'm going to have a look at 10 meters and we'll see if there's anyone up there. Golf 4 Yankee Victor Mike. Golf 4 Yankee Victor Mike. Thank you. Uh, this is Golf 4 Yankee Victor Mike. Golf 4 Yankee Victor Mike portable calling. Golf 4 Yankee Victor Mike Portable. G4 Yankee. G4 Yankee Victor Mike Portable. Yankee Victoria Mexico Portable 59, thank you. 59, thank you, you also. 73s. Yeah, Chief, QRP. There you go, 10 meters. Just heard him, called him, worked him. That's the sleeve antenna. I'm going to keep this thing around. If I hear anything else, I'll click the record button again. On 10 meters, there's repeaters coming through, and there's well. Uh, copied 57, thank you. It's Golf 4 Yankee Victor Mug Portable. Golf 4 Yankee Victor Mug Portable. You're a 5x9 with me. Name is David and I'm in Salisbury. Over. Yeah, I'm on Pepper Box Hill, Pepper Box Hill, Pepper Box Hill, and uh, QSB, you've gone down 5x3, five 5x3, by three, five by three, over. Well, he wasn't 5x9, <laughs> but a 5x3 in the QSB is fine by me. That was on 40 meters, he worked me there. That was good news. There's a guy on 10 who now appears to have gone uh, and I was trying to get hold of. Never mind. There's another guy there. But anyway, what can I say? I'm going to turn that off for the time being. That's, um, that's the sleeve antenna. It, as you can see, it does work. Um, it's pretty hot here, to be honest, and it's, it's very frustrating. I'm just feeling the back of the rig. It's getting warm. Very frustrating having to have the engine running, really, to get the, the battery out of the, uh, out of the car. It's not my car. It's my son's car. I don't tell him I've got it. But uh, there we are. Um, if you want to see Pepperbox Hill, you may have heard it. I'll just give you a quick glimpse around. <coughs> So there we are, and through there you can just see the uh, the pepper box itself. It's the monument. That's why it's called Pepper Box Hill. And you can see behind me. Uh, it's really very pretty. I'll show you my. This is the the sleeve antenna. Um, this is my uh, uh, my um, Anon. This is uh, you wouldn't. I don't use those anymore. Um, I don't use BNC anymore. I use um, SO239, and that's the sleeve. That's how I've got it mounted on the car. Uh, a run of coax, too much coax in my case, <laughs> to the radio, and uh, it works a treat. I now sell these in um, blue. 
uh, as well as uh, the the black and the green and the camo the black have gone up in price would you believe over lockdown the cost of black nylon has doubled uh, the other for some reason the other colors haven't they're still the same price they ever were but the, the black nylon has doubled in price if you can get it uh, which is a bit odd so um, I can't imagine I'll be selling to oh, I've added it at five pounds to the price which covers the cost of the, of the increase in cloth and it's as simple as that so there we are that's it hope you enjoyed this little video and I'll catch you later cheers <laughs>